you know, back when I came to this incredible country, it was um, just looking for an opportunity. So life is like a box of chocolate, right? Mm -hmm. So becoming a chef, you know, it was those kind of things that lay on my lap. And, um, you know, I can now feel pretty comfortable to say that I never look back. I was just a decent student. Um, back in those days, I, I don't know if you remember this well, but um, I took some tests uh, to graduate orally because I was not able to, to write English. You know, my head's up to the faculty for letting me, you know, do that at that point in time. In those days, you know, those uh, uh, teachers and maestros, they were incredible. And I can tell you this much, uh, I remember one of them, like, you know, on a daily basis. So I just thinking of them, you know, what would be the best way to approach this recipe or, or to tell somebody, you know, how to cook this dish or they, in my, in my memories, uh, and, uh, and also in every single day of my life, they're there. So I truly appreciate them. Definitely my favorite thing to cook, it gotta be barbacoa in uh, this incredible state and through the country, we call it barbecue. And uh, that to me is the ultimate um, bio food that you can possibly try. I love to build layer on top of layer on top of layer of food. And my grandmother's mole, it was uh, 21 ingredients, deli mole. And so to me, that is the ultimate challenge. Both my daughter Sophia and I uh, wanted to do something special for Hugo. We felt like he grown himself so much uh, and HCC was a big part of that. So we wanted to recognize that connection and do something special uh, in Hugo's honor. You gotta help the people that need it more than you. And uh, what a great opportunity for me that I can feed one person or I know how to feed, you know, a, a city or a state or, uh, you know, participate on, on whatever it needs to be done to help our community. You know, bringing my energy and, and dedication to the community is my number one priority. And I cannot thank this uh, incredible city to you know, to be where, where we are today. And, uh, and you know, I thank this city from the bottom of my heart. I am a Houstonian. I'm part of H-Town uh, city, so that is pretty dang good. <laughs> For all of us, uh, you know, life uh, takes different paths. I would tell the students to be passionate about what they do and, you know, don't, uh, pay attention of anything except to follow follow the, the dream and uh, believe in who they are and uh, always go at it with 120 percent with every single ounce of energy in their body and uh, i think that would conduce them to find themselves <laughs>